What is, huh, oh, it's dark in here. Oh yeah. What is up guys? Today I've been challenged to do the hashtag bad ombre challenge. What that means is that you're going to take a tumbler, you're going to pick some colors, you're going to spray paint it blindfolded, and then you're going to glitter it blindfolded. So it sounds like it'll turn out fantastic. But anyway, we're going to try it. We're going to do it. I want to give a shout out to Jessica from Flint Sisters Boutique for inviting me into this crazy challenge. It should be a lot of fun. If you have not seen the other videos in this challenge, click on the hashtag under this video right here, bad ombre challenge and it'll bring up all those videos and just have listen have a fun time because i have laughed my butt off i've seen glittered laps and just like everywhere mess oh, no. okay if i were to be blindfolded and needing to do a tumbler i feel like to prepare for this i need to do a little bit of training so i know that i'm ready to tackle the not being able to see art work let's go making some brick oh it's ready Yeah, perfect. I am ready. All right, now that I've finished my ninja training, I feel fully competent to do this absolutely blindfolded. So let's get started. All righty, I have went ahead. I've pre shooken shaken my cans. I don't remember which one I put where. Uh, so I don't know what color's gonna be the top, what color's gonna be the bottom. I've got this bandana really tight. So whatever this is, is gonna be uh, the bottom. Maybe. Oh my gosh. Who's I doing with this? This is, this is so hard. Oh my gosh. Okay. Uh, let me fill up. I hope I got this turned the right way. I think so. I think so. We'll go with it. If I spray my hand, then I know that it's wrong. Oh my gosh. I feel like I'm making a mess. Start right here. I feel like that's a lot. Oh, I feel it spraying on my hand. Why is it splattering on my hand? Okay, that should be good for the number one color. Color number two. Let's feel the little nozzle. There it is. Is it? Maybe. I don't know. I can't. Jeez, I cannot tell. Okay, oh, there's the, there's the tumbler. Okay, here we go. Technique muscle memory, don't fail me now. Okay, okay, I think, I think I'm done. Let's see. Hey, what? I kind of missed the whole middle there. Whoa, I missed the whole top there. What was I doing? Well, you can't fix it. You just gotta go with it. So I'm gonna let this dry. Oh, I got the, ah, okay. Yeah, hopefully the glittering goes better. All right, next. All right, this is dry. Well, not anymore, because I just put some epoxy on it. I'm gonna do some glittering with the corresponding color. I have to remember where I put, I want the pink to go on the, the pink because it wouldn't really make sense if I put the pink on the blue. Could be a happy accident, I don't know. But I wanna let you know that I'm using the Illumilite, the brand new Quick Cast cuts your time in half and I'll have a link in the description and you can use discount code Duncan 10 to get a uh, 10% off. You're welcome. And I want to give a quick little shout out to little Lee and Rose for sending me these glitters here. They sent me a nice little pack. There's more over there. But the crazy thing is I picked these spray paint colors out before I even opened the package to see what colors they sent. So that worked out perfectly. So I've got some epoxy on here. I'm gonna sit it down, put on my blindfold and then we'll get to making a mess. All right, should be beautiful. I mean, if it's not, I'll say it is, and I'll lie to you. I mean, um, let's go. Put my blindfold on. Whew, okay, here goes nothing. 
Hopefully I hit it. I'm trying to use my ears to hear. Is it coming out? I don't hear anything falling. I still don't hear anything falling. Ah, there it goes. Okay, okay. I can't tell if I'm hitting. Wish I had a big old shaker, like with tons of glitter that I could go round for like 30 minutes so I would know that I got it covered because I feel like if I had to do it again, which I won't, I would do some more spray painting. Okay, just dump it, baby. Don't be scared. Don't be scared. Just go for it. Okay. Ah, uh, okay. I feel like I'm pretty good. Probably went around it 10 times. Let's move my paper. Clean all that. Oh gosh, it's everywhere. Maybe I'll clean it up. Jeez. I can grab my, there we go. Move it over. Come on, baby. Where's the other one? There. Oh, I touched it up. There it is. Alrighty. Here's the blue and we got to angle it a different way. Try not to touch it on the table. Okay. Wait, wait, wait. Where's the bottom? Oh, that is the cup. There it is. I hope I didn't mess nothing up. Okay, here we go. This is not chunky, so I won't be able to hear it. I'm just going for it. I hope that I'm doing a good job. I wish I could hear you guys like, you're missing, you're going great, or that's gonna be terrible. It's really hard to tell if it's even coming out. Hear absolutely nothing hitting the, the paper. Is it coming out? Am I tilting it enough, guys and gals? Come on, I need, I need to sense your presence with me. It's got to be coming out. Like I feel like I didn't even get any all out of this cup. Did, did I? Is it done? I don't know. Okay, I think for the ombre you're supposed to. Oh, wait, 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 wait. I, I, yeah, my cup's empty. Let's try to salvage it. I'm holding this between my legs. This is dangerous, bro. Oh, it slipped. I about dropped it. Oh, it's slipping again. Oh, hold tighter legs. Come on, man. Oh, 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 there it is. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, okay, okay. Where's my cup? Dude, my legs are giving out, bro. Come on. Okay, okay, okay. Uh, I wish I could see. Jeez, I just either made it in the cup because I feel it with this finger right here. I feel like I made some. Oh, it's all over my hands. Oh, now I don't have a clue. Okay, I can touch the top and then just, I'm just gonna load it, bro. Just full send, full send, bro. And I may, I may not. Okay, there's top of the tumbler. Can you see this, ladies and gentlemen? Am I, am I holding this up? I'm out again. I, I'm gonna have to call it. I believe, oh, I got stuff all over my hands. I believe, let's, let's take a peek. Okay, well, okay. Oh my gosh. Get down here and see this, look at this. Would you look at that, oh my gosh. No wonder, I totally missed the cup that last time. All right, I totally missed the cup. Wow, that's such pretty stuff too. Oh, how did epoxy get on my cup on the side? Ah, oh boy. All right, I'm just gonna put this on the turner and I'm gonna let it roll. I'm gonna pat these chunky bad boys down because, because it's the quick coat, I'm gonna let it roll for two hours and then I'm gonna put another layer of epoxy on it and then I believe the next thing you'll see is what I'm gonna do to finish it off. And I have an idea, because I bought something new last night and I wanna try it out and see if it works. That's why I picked these colors, so uh, yeah, let's go. All right, all right, all right, all right. Calm down, just take it easy. You caught me, big deal. Hey, listen, in my defense, technically the challenge was over. I did the whole blindfoldy thingy and, and besides, in doing this challenge, I realized how ridiculous 
ridiculously hard it is to do things without the use of your eyeballs. I'm just sitting here trying to make a tumbler, but there's people that have to do this every day and I thought, man, that's so hard. What I'm gonna do with this before I show it to you is I'm going to put this on eBay. There's a listing in the description below. Head right down there uh, after this video. The highest bidder is gonna get this cup. All of that money is going to be donated to my local deaf and blind school, which I thought would be a good idea. Help somebody out because wow, that is really hard not being able to see. Hey, put a blindfold on, walk around the house, make some coffee, try to make yourself breakfast. I mean, come on. And then try to make a cup, you know? It's hard. Give me a new perspective for people who can't see. So I just thought that would be a great thing to do is we're going to raise money. Highest bidder is going to get this. Are you ready? Oh, there you go. Bad ombre challenge. Got the drip lips on it. Drip lips are still available on the website. You can download these and I actually used a silhouette paper. It is holographic. I didn't know it was transparent, but it still turned out pretty cool. Uh, it'd probably be cool if you put a white behind it. So it turned out really cool. My Cricut does not read off the reflective holographic silhouette paper. So I had to cut it out by hand, but the drip lips, once again, saving the day of this bad ombre. Link in the description. Here's a little montage of the beauty of this ugly, bad ombre. <laughs>